I first came to Nate's ministry as a client, actually. I had been struggling with same-sex attractions myself and not not feeling like I had uh, any answers um, going to churches or pastors and them not knowing what to do about my struggle. And finally, um, coming to Nate and finding hope that there was transformation, um, that, was, that was important to me, that was attractive to me, that I could have the life that God called me to um, with, you know, w with the provision of his grace for me. Agape First Ministries is about uh, equipping the church to help those who are struggling with same-sex attractions, to be able to understand the issues that are at play, to be able to respond to the world's narrative about this issue uh, in a biblical and loving, truthful way. One of the great efforts of Agape First Ministries is being able to evangelize to those who identify themselves as gay or transgender, um, or even those in the church who don't hold those identities, but also have same-sex attractions and don't know where to go with them. And Agape First is able to reach out to those people and minister to them and tell them that God does love them, that we love them, uh, and that there is hope for their transformation. There is hope for them just to live a life that, of, of God's calling and their own choosing. Agape First Ministries has regular programming to support those who are struggling with same-sex attractions, to, um, to help them walk in the footsteps of the life that God has called them to. Uh, it, it can be difficult, you know, I can speak from my experience, it can be difficult walking with same-sex attractions and overcoming them. Uh, it's not an easy battle, but Agape First Ministries provides the resources and the teaching uh, to help me um, realize that Jesus is coming alongside me to let him do that and walk that, um, walk that life with me. The biggest thing that anyone can do for Agape First Ministries is to pray. Uh, the power of prayer is absolutely by far the most powerful tool that we have. Prayer is what delivers uh, transformation, it's what brings healing, and, and most of all, it's what brings connection with our Savior, with our Redeemer. Um, prayer is the number one most important thing that somebody could do to help Agape First Ministries. Other than prayer, there's always the opportunity to give financially um, and also to volunteer time and resources. I do what I do because I have come from a life that was dominated by same-sex attractions, where I was desperate for hope and healing for a life that was different than what the world said was my only option. And I've experienced that transformation myself. My attractions and desires are transformed. Uh, it is different than it used to be. I have changed by the power of Jesus, um, by the power of connecting with him. And that's a message of hope that I want everybody to have, that I want everybody to know, that no matter what your struggle is, there is hope for change from the inside out. There is hope for connection and healing for the pain that you might be feeling inside. There is hope for a life that is uh, abundant and full of joy with Jesus. Agape First Ministries is, is foremost about connection with Jesus. Uh, more than change, more than your desires, more than where you came from or where you think you want to go, it's about connecting with the Father, connecting with Jesus and the Holy Spirit, and living a life that is uh, fully in relationship with God. Oh.